Hello, right, something new this week. I don't really cover much Arduino stuff. I really should do more Arduino stuff because it's cool. But as you can see, we have a board, and this is an Arduino Mega compatible board, but it's tiny. Hence the rulers next to it if you get a scale reference. It's about 55 millimeters long compared to a Arduino Mega, which is massive. It's got lots of pins. This has got the same amount of pins. We've got 50 something GPIO pins. I think it's 53, 54, something like that. Of which we have a lot of digital and we have lots of analog pins. I got this because it was about £7 from eBay. I wanted to see if it was any good to use Arduino Mega compatible boards for projects where I need lots of pins but also small size of board. So I plugged it in, it blinked, which was always a good start. And then I just put the blink sketch on, and you can see on the right here I have the blink sketch running. Modified it a bit to control two pins, 53 and 35, chosen at random. And I just got them going high and low, on and off, with a half second delay between each one. So I'm just going to change this on the fly so you can see it. It's just a really nifty little board. It's cheap, it's powerful, I've got lots of GPIO pins. And it just works with the Arduino IDE. I haven't got to mess around. No special boards need to be imported in the board library or anything like that. It just works. Really happy. So, as I say, about £7 from eBay. I'm looking to try and find some from AliExpress a bit cheaper. So, I'll keep you posted. Anyway, cheers.